stomach is primary if you think about it even for less than a second. We eat, we live. When a baby first comes out of the womb, there's breath into the air, and a short while later, there's sense of hunger, and hunger is a sign that there is life. And then there's the digestive process to become conscious about what we eat is a pretty advanced step after that initially and the stomach is like that like is a baby it's primal it's basic and so to belittle or shout at your stomach's urges that are actually prelingual is as unkind as shouting at a baby. The urges may have come in with you from even before your, you were born, in your DNA, in your bones, in your very uh, beingness. You don't know what you're faced with. This is not a reason to have an excuse not to upgrade and uplift your eating habits, but it's just to be respectful of yourself that you don't necessarily know what is going on and uh, to focus on upgrading rather than belittling or making making your eating habits wrong. If you crave bread, for instance, and sweet things, these are of the earth element. It's to, cre to crave a solidity in your life, to create, crave an anchor and um, a uh, potentially a verticality. So it's, it's not to make it wrong, it's to look at the craving for heavier food, which is sweet food, which is earthy food, which is the meats, the cheeses, and actually say, okay, I'm needing substance in my life in some way. I am not receiving it in a way that is uplifting for me. So my baby stomach is just going, wow, wow, give me bread. And until consciously we find a um, something more fitting because our digestive system, of course, changes through our life, if you think what a baby eats compared to even a kid and then a teenager uh, can eat so many things and then uh, into, as we age, into older age, uh, if you're finding that you are unable to digest something that you could previously digest, it means that your digestion is changing. So come back to simple and have a broth, a light broth, turmeric, uh, put some, uh, if, if you don't have too much inflammation, tiny bit of ginger, a little bit of garlic, just for the taste, the turmeric for all the benefits to the digestive system, soupy stew with some greens and broccoli, 
um, maybe some a little sweet potato and some pumpkin and some root vegetables like little bits of beetroot uh, carrots so, uh, spritz of of black pepper which helps digest the the turmeric which you can research all the benefits of that reducing inflammation in the body um, and then adding a swizzle of olive oil or maybe coconut oil uh, once it's off the heat. Uh, maybe some spinach leaves. Staying away from the cabbages uh, because they can be gassy. Broccoli rather than cauliflower. And obviously... If you have specific health concerns, you need to check in with your doctor uh, for your specific, but just like a simple soupy stew and then taking taking a, a little rest from uh, heavier stuff, uh, introduce one at a time. If you find yourself with constipation or bloatiness or heaviness in the tummy then you know that something's not digesting equally if you're drinking lots of water it is going to it can dilute the digestive juices it can flush away um good stuff like a like a flood flush away the good stuff with with other stuff so drinking little but through the day but uh, what the tendency can be is to way overdo it and then for some people you get water bloating and enema edema, edema where you uh, literally there's uh, too much water in the system um, which in itself it is can be a major problem so um, just also knowing that the uh, digestive system, some people have very strong, strong uh, digestion and others variable and others, it's, it's weak. And it may be that at this time of your life, it's not so strong. So uh, soupy stew, uh, Lots of raw food can be difficult to digest. And if you're tending towards constipation at the moment, then uh, lightly steamed, uh, a little bit of fresh, but not overdoing it. Perhaps some um, well-ripe sweet fruit, but uh, not lots of raw carrots and uh, uh, salads which may be difficult on your digestion right now. These are just a few initial suggestions to try out. How, the, how you know anything is helping you is if you feel better. Um, you feel, ah, oh, oh, that heaviness, that hardness, that gassiness, it's reducing. I'm feeling more myself. You want things to be moving through within 24 hours. If they're not, then there's something that's not digesting. Uh, some There's some food intolerance. Maybe you could digest it before and maybe you can't anymore because digestibility does change. This is just a few, as I was saying, initial little suggestions to get you starting on a reset and taking the he uh, the heavier stuff out of your diet or reducing it down if you're feeling really really unwell then soupy broth is probably um, a good bit place to just stay for a few days uh, to ease the digestion and to like uh, uh, comfort the baby's stomach inside yourself 
once again because stomach can start panicking uh, if you snatch away, like you would snatch away food from a baby. And uh, then it with a too drastic food adjustment. So reset, reset. Rather take this as a process of I'm learning about myself. I'm going to I'm going to get to know myself really, really well. This is what food and diet can be. And I can't emphasize that enough. I know I, I go on about that a lot. But um, it's wonderful to hear how you're getting on. Uh, I know for myself, it's a journey. It's a journey. It's one where, wow, I, um, I'm learning patience with myself because parts of me are more conscious and more evolved and then there are bits of me as with it as with everybody but certainly also with me that are baby and uh, are not nearly as evolved as my ego would like so gently gently poco 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 step by step just keep learning about yourself also through the food, because that will reap so many health benefits. Patience, good luck, Satna. And don't delay it either. Right now, what is possible, and it may simply be to take one deep, strong, breath instead of rushing for a little snack. Okay, Satnam. <laughs>